All right, this is a big one. The biggest flyweight championship fight in MMA history takes place this Saturday in the co-main event of UFC 283 in Brazil. And in my opinion, it's the people's main event. This is a record-setting fourth fight between Davidson Figueiredo and Brandon Moreno. The first fight was a fighter of the year contender, and I believe that that was the last time we saw prime Davidson Figueiredo. In the second fight, Moreno looked new and improved and managed to submit the very timid Davison Figueredo, who I believe had a very, very bad weight cut. And the last time in the trilogy, Davison, in my eyes, clearly won a 48-47 decision. However, a lot of people thought Moreno was robbed. And that, to me, just shows how much people were biased towards Moreno because he's the more likable guy. But even though Davison won and reclaimed his belt, I definitely don't see him beating Moreno in the fourth fight. Every time Moreno landed a shot, Figgy would be hurt, and it was really obvious. And that fight will be a day shy of a year since it took place um, on Saturday. So, literally 364 days on fight night is when the last fight took place. And Davison is now 35, which is really old for a flyweight. He's coming off, I believe, hand surgery. And with another hard weight cut, I could easily see Moreno finishing this fight like he did in the second fight. Brandon has a newfound aggression and confidence to his game, and that's good, but it definitely hurt him in the trilogy with Davison. He used to have such a clean, tight guard, but now his hands are wide open and lower, and a still powerful Figueredo managed to drop Brandon three times in the trilogy. But Brandon is faster and way more fluid and creative in his striking since their first fight, and is still obviously a great grappler. I think this fight goes a lot like the second where Davison has a rough weight cut and looks slow. And I can see Brandon taking the first couple of rounds slowly because he fought really aggressively in the third fight and paid the price. But once he sees Figgy is offering much resistance, I see Moreno pressing the gas and knocking him down in the fourth round and securing the victory of ground and pound. So to recap, I got Moreno via round four TKO. Thanks for watching and hey, I'm just a kid and this is my opinion.